Mm -hmm. Nope, you're not at all. So we had a motion to come out of non-public. We have to do a roll call vote for coming out of non-public. Aye. 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 Seal the minutes. All in favor. Aye. Okay. And road agent. Road agent. Uh, Wayne, you want to come up? And you tell us what you got. It's not going to be a quickie, Butch. <laughs> <laughs> You guys want to talk about this 47 uh, Offer Drive? This guy was supposed to come in, but he's got a problem with the water coming in into his drive. You had mentioned you went there, so why don't you just talk Tell about what happened. happened? Tell us your thoughts from going over and looking okay. at the property. Well, his, his driveway is right in the middle of the hill. So, so back. What, nobody knows what we're talking about. 47 Northrop Drive said because of paving. Their driveway is now flooding, causing frost heaves and damage to their property. I went down and his driveway is right is right in the middle of the hill. His house is down in a hole. Down in a hole. So all so it's like a fishbowl almost? Huh? It's like a fishbowl. Yeah, well come down you come down the hill and his house is down here in the, in the driveway and everything. So all the water, it looks like all the water. Is coming off the off the road. That that road down there is made so half the water goes on this side, half the raw water on the other side. Before it all went in one area. It just stayed on one side of the road, and, but it's changed now. When we when we did that, they, and they did that on purpose, so half the water go here and half the water go there. So the amount of water that goes down the hill, I mean, it just his house is in the wrong place now. It, it just. It just runs right off, right down through his lawn and right, right through his driveway. Now, it probably costs quite a lot of money to fix that. You put a swale down through there, but we, we, we talked about it, uh, putting a uh, catch basin in there, try to catch some of the water, but then you've got to you put a catch basin there. You've got to go across his land with, with uh, a culvert, and that's a long distance. Well, that, that's going to cost money. Oh, oh, you can, you can, Cut the side of the road out and put a swale down there and, and put the swale down across it. But the other th problem we're going to have down there when it gets down the, the bottom of the hill, it's going to run in the other guy's driveway. So it's going to be a hard fix. <coughs> have you ever uh, talked to the town engineer about this particular property? Uh, no, this is the first time I've had anything to do with that. Uh, well, I'd like to I make that suggestion that we get the town engineer to look at it. I mean, I could, I, I, I can, I can, uh, I can bring uh, John Bell down here and see if there's any any way that we can do it. I mean, they they, they wouldn't know right away. But he's gonna be here anyway. For the yeah, he's gonna be here. Bring him down here. I can tell him what's going on. I don't know if there's any, any way that they can. Okay. To see well, uh, as long as I think you should get positive. I think you should get the town engineer. Is he home yet? Or was he away? I don't know. Yeah, he's in Florida. Oh. Been in Florida all winter. When he's away in Florida, though, he has his son filled in. Oh, he does. Yeah, his son works for SFC, and he'll come out. Okay. Yeah, because I, I want to. That, that's another problem that I got. Yeah. Well, maybe we can get both at the same time, Mr. Okay. Bell and the town engineer. Yeah. But I think that would be. I have no problem with that. Yeah, yeah I think that's. So, we have a motion and a second. We're all in favor of getting the town engineer. I'll make the motion. I'll second it. All in favor? Aye. 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 There you go. Okay. Uh, what yep. else you got? The other thing, uh, uh, Dry Road East, we're hoping to start that. We're hoping, we'll, I thought we were going to start it this week, but John had something he's going to do, so we're probably going to start that next week. He, John wants to try to get it done, get this whole, get that whole thing done down there. Let's put in the culvert and everything else. Everything. Yeah. Once we start, we're going to keep going right through to get it done. That road's closed down there. Yeah. Right, so. And uh, so I've talked to some of the people down there. They have no problem. Um, hopefully, we'll get it done by the end of April if we get going did, on it. Did uh, somebody make a motion? One of that they wanted us to mail letters, or we still mail letters from people on notice, or? versus having Wayne knock on their doors. I think that was when we were talking about the public hearing. Right. Yes. Yeah, I think. There's only 20 houses down here. 
just go knock on the door. I mean, they know what's going on. Uh, some of them I already, I've already talked to down there. Anyway. How about a prepared flyer that you can deliver? Because not everybody's going to be home. I gave them all that last time. Yeah. I made I mean, one. I I well, now we have a new date. When we were cutting the show, oh, yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll change that all over. Wait, did you order your message board? What's that? Your electronic message yeah, board? Yeah, that's the other thing uh, that I got on here for you. To, uh, that message board is going to be here in, within the next two weeks. So Not hopefully we can put that up for, for this road. That would be awesome. <laughs> the next two weeks, uh, they, they called and said. Unfortunately, it's probably going to show up the day. They're going to deliver it. I guess they're going to deliver it because we got to have the class on it and they can get it down here. So um, they call back. I don't know just when the date is going on. I don't know if we have to have a check to pay them as soon as they get there or what, but I figured I better tell you ahead no, of time. No, because my look at checks on Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. Okay. Uh, uh, back to Railroad uh, East. There was discussion about having the town engineer involved in the paving process. Mm -hmm. So we need to make sure that happens. For the culvert? No, for the whole project. For, well, Railroad East is different than the Railroad West. Yeah, that's the thing I need. Two different I'm going to need him for the Brow Road West. Okay. Because, uh, well, all the problems. Are you paving east too? East. Yeah, yes. You're fixing the culvert though. No, the same as paving it as well. Yeah, we got one culvert. Just we got one culvert down there. We're going to put in. Mm -hmm. You're going to redo the whole road. I want the whole thing. Oh, okay. I thought you were just re. re uh, Any paving yeah. the culvert project, the town yeah. engineers need to be involved. I right? agree. I think that's a great idea. Okay. Because he, he brings experience and knowledge that we just don't possess. Uh, Gravel Road West is uh, that's another thing down there. But uh, putting that down, I think we're going to need a plan down there because uh, we've got to be careful when we're dealing with DES and all that down in there. So because that's a river, the Exeter River, that and digging down there. So I I'd like to get the. Uh, Steve Cummings involved in that because sure. I, they, they, they yeah. I don't want to get into any messes. So, yeah, so if you're going to have him looking at Northrop, you might as well just try to set up where you're doing Northrop, Raw Road East and West all at the same time. Kill. Yeah. And if you need me to show up my Jeep and drive him down that nice road, I will. Okay. And then, um, um, this weekend, this weekend they called me, they're having a trash pickup on Saturday. And who, for who? For who? The town. Where? Oh, yeah. is it? Is it? Um, Con conservation. conservation. Spring cleaning. Conservation. Yeah. Is it Earth Day? Yep. I guess so. On the twentieth. Earth Day. Yeah. And uh, we usually get a big dump. We last year we get we ended up getting a big dumpster because the year before they had so much stuff. If we had it all over the yard down there, and because I can't put it in the big, our big dumpster down there, because we got household stuff, and because they bring trash, and mm -hmm. so we bring in a big, another big dumpster and have it there. Cause, but they, when uh, conservation uh, person called, uh, they're going to have rain Saturday, so they're not sure how many people they're going to have picking up. But I said, well. So I don't know what, what you guys want to do. But do we have special bags for that? We get the special bags for free from um, They have recovery. everything. But, it, but I think we should get a dumpster from Penaglia. The dumpster's like 350 Yeah. I, I it's, it's just to drop it off, right? They drop it off? They drop it off and then they come pick yeah, it up okay. Monday. And then we pick it today. Yeah, because they're going to have to do the... It's got a thousand for that. Yeah. Believe me, we've been doing brush on the side of the roads off for the last three weeks. We well, have a huge windstorm. Wind too. There'll too. be enough stuff in that to, to fill up one of them. Well, all the stuff that's on the roads, it's terrible. And I saw you guys were going to be burning too. Are you chipping or are you burning? The chipping, the chipping. We're out chipping. chipping. Can, okay. Yep, we're out chipping, and we're also uh, well, we got the brush pile down there. We'll be burning brush too. It would burn when you were on vacation. Yeah, and we got quite a bit of brushes coming in, so. Okay. Last Saturday, I had a lot, and I had a lot of time to brush, so. So when you just want the dumpster by Friday, and then you call and pick it up whenever? Yeah. So they're going to do with a cleanup on Saturday no matter what? Rain or shine? Rain or shine, they said. Okay. But they just don't know how many people they're going to. 
Well, I know there was trash day today and the wind was so high, I know I was picking up culverts today. I went out there with a the trash bag just in my neighborhood and just picking stuff up. So there's probably going to be a ton of trash, so I imagine that thing's going to get full of water. All right. Okay. Any motion for that? Anything else? That's all I got. Do. Anything else? Anybody in the public? Just, uh, I happened to run into Joyce Kegel today, and I, I said I'd ask: it, Has the Boeing um, contract been awarded, and they've accepted? That's a done deal. Mm -hmm. It was awarded to ASAP Landscaping, and they're going to be in touch with all of the departments this week, which I did let Joyce know today. No, I had to stay because I forgot to ask you about the Boston Post cane. Yes. Oh, I forgot too. I ordered them. They came in oh, yesterday, yes. I think. Oh, excellent. So I have oh. to take them up to Dover to have them engraved, and oh. then I have to have that plaque engraved before you can. But, and I'm not still sure if the county home is on quarantine still. They were quarantined? Oh, yeah. They've got a bad case of some disease over there. Oh, please let me know before we go. <laughs> I've been sitting all winter. I don't want anything else. They won't let us go there if it's in Perfect. Quarantine. <laughs> okay, so, so I still got time then. Who is that? Yeah, the nursing home was, assisted living wasn't, but the nursing home was on quarantine. I know it was a Friday they were, it was on Friday. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Uh, I make a motion to adjourn. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. I got you. Oh, I'll get it, because I'm going to figure out.